We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which, in which we partake, we partake of, of Christ, Christ, His sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave you us, us the Eucharist as a memorial of your suffering and death. death. May our, our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be done it to me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, and now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, and now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we, we beseech you, beseech you o, Lord, o Lord, your grace into our hearts, hearts that, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Joyful Mysteries The first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, and now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery, the birth of Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy, o Holy Mother, Mother of God. God. Despise not our petitions in our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, for ever glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray, O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech you, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord had sought over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of Saint Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we praise you as we weigh the truth and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, God, the Holy Spirit, Advocate, Advocate and Guide, we bless you, and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to the holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you. Let our salvation be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all, in the gospel we share to all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today is Monday in the 12th week of Ordinary Time. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips and my mouth shall declare, declare your praise. praise. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Cry out with joy to the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before Him, singing for joy. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Know that He, the Lord, is God. He made us. We belong to Him. We are His people, the sheep of His flock. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Go within His gates, giving thanks. Enter his courts with songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal his merciful love. 
He is faithful from age to age. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us sing joyful songs to the Lord. Please be seated. Each morning, Lord, you fill us with your kindness. O Lord, you have been our refuge from one generation to the next, before the mountains were born, or the earth, or the world brought forth. You are God without beginning or end. You turn men back to dust and say, Go back, sons of men, to your eyes a thousand years are like yesterday, come and gone, no more than a watch in the night. You sweep man away like a dream, like grass which springs up in the morning. In the morning it springs up and flowers, by evening it withers and fades. So we are destroyed in your anger, struck with terror in your fury. Our guilt lies open before you, our secrets in the light of your face. All our days pass away in your anger, our life is over like a scythe. Our span is seventy years, or eighty, for those who are strong. And most of these are emptiness and pain. They pass swiftly and we are gone. Who understand the power of your anger and fear the strength of your fury. Make us know the shortness of our life, that we may gain wisdom of heart. Lord, relent is your anger forever. Show pity to your servants. In the morning, fill us with your love. We shall exult and rejoice all our days. Give us joy to balance our affliction for the years when we knew misfortune. Show forth your word to your servants. Let your glory shine on their children. Let the favor of the Lord be upon us. Give success to the work of our hands. Give success to the work of our hands. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. From the farthest bounds of earth, may God be praised. Sing to the Lord a new song, His praise from the end of the earth. Let the sea and what fills it resound, the coastlands and those who dwell in them. Let the steep and its cities cry out, the villages where Kedar dwells. Let the inhabitants of Sel exult and shout from the top of the mountains. Let them give glory to the Lord and utter his praise in the coastlands. The Lord goes forth like a hero, like a warrior, he stirs up his ardor. He shouts out his battle cry. Against his enemies, he shows his might. I have looked away and kept silence. I have said nothing, holding myself in. But now I cry out as a woman in labor, gasping and panting. I will lay waste mountains and hills. All their herbage I will dry up. I will turn the rivers into marshes, and the marshes I will dry up. I will lead the blind on their journey. By paths unknown I will guide them. I will turn darkness into light before them and make crooked ways straight. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. You who stand in his sanctuary, praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise him, servants of the Lord, who stand in the house of the Lord, in the course of the house of our God. Praise the Lord, for the Lord is good. Sing a psalm to his name, for he is loving. For the Lord has chosen Jacob for himself and Israel for his own possession. For I know the Lord is great, that our Lord is high above all gods. The Lord does whatever he wills, in heaven, on earth, in the seas. He summons clouds from the ends of the earth, makes lightning produce the rain. From his treasuries he sends forth the wind. The firstborn of the Egyptians he smote, of man and beast alike. Signs and wonders he worked in the midst of your land, O Egypt against Pharaoh and all his servants. Nations in their greatness he struck, and kings in their splendor he slew. Sihon, king of Amorites, Og, the king of Bashan, and all the kingdoms of Canaan. He let Israel inherit their land. On his people their land be bestowed. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. 
Grant, O Lord, that we may always revere and love your holy name, for you never deprive of your guidance those you set firm on the foundation of your love. To our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the second book of Kings. Shalmaneser, king of Assyria, occupied the whole land and attacked Samaria, which he besieged for three years. In the ninth year of Hosea, king of Israel, the king of Assyria took Samaria and deported the children of Israel to Assyria, setting them in Hala at the Habor, a river of Gozan, and the cities of the Medes. This came about because the children of Israel sinned against the Lord their God, who had brought them up from the land of Egypt, from under the domination of Pharaoh, king of Egypt, and because they venerated other gods. They followed the rites of the nations whom the Lord had cleared out of the way of the children of Israel and the kings of Israel whom they set up. And though the Lord warned Israel and Judah by every prophet and seer, give up your evil ways and keep my commandments and statutes in accordance with the entire law which I enjoyed on our fathers and which I sent you by my servants, the prophets. They did not listen, but were as stiff-necked as their fathers, who had not believed in the Lord their God. They rejected the statutes, the covenants which he had made with their fathers, and the warning which he had given them, till in his great anger against Israel. The Lord put them away out of his sight. Only the tribe of Judah was left. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Help us with your right hand, O Lord, and answer us. Help us with your right hand, O Lord, and answer us. O God, you have rejected us and broken our defenses. You have been angry. Rally us. Help us with your right hand, O Lord, and answer us. You have rocked the country and split it open. Repair the cracks in it, for it is tottering. You have made your people feel hardships. You have given a stupefying wine. Help us with your right hand, O Lord, and answer us. Have not you, O God, rejected us, so that you go not forth, O God, with our armies? Give us aid against the foe, for worthless is the health of men. Help us with your right hand, O Lord, and answer us. Please stand. of God is living and effective, able to discern reflections and thoughts of the heart. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, Stop judging that you may not be judged. For as you judge, so will you be judged. And the measure with which you measure will be measured out to you. Why do you notice the splinter in your brother's eye? 
but do not perceive the wooden beam in your own eye. How can you say to your brother, Let me remove the splinter from your eye, while the wooden beam is in your eye? You hypocrite, remove the wooden beam from your eye first, then you will see clearly to remove the splinter from your brother's eye. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, o Lord Jesus Christ. Christ. Please be seated. Huwag humusga ng hindi mahusgahan. Talaga bang pinagbabawal na ang humusga? Paano yung mga magulang na kailangan humusga sa pag-uugali ng kanilang mga anak upang maitaguyod ang mga anak nila sa mabuting buhay, maitumpak kung mali, at purihin kung tama ang ginagawa ng kanilang mga anak. Paano yung mga guro na nagtuturo ng katotohanan? Kailangan husgahan nila kung ang mga kasagutan at inuugali ng mga nag-aaral sa ilalim nila ay tama o mali. Paano yung mga mamamayan na may malasakit sa bayan? Hindi na ba sila magpapahayag ng kanilang pagkukuro tungkol sa ikagagaling ng pamahalaan para nang sa gano'n ni maalagaan hindi lamang kapakanan ng ilan kundi kapakanan ng lahat. Bawal na ba yon? Ilagay natin sa konteksto kung ano ang pinagbabawal na paghusga. Ano ba yung pinagbabawal na paghusga? na sinasabi dito sa ating ibanghelyo na kababasa lamang. Alam nyo, kapag tayo nagtututuro, sabi nga natin kadalasan, yung tatlo nakaturo sa atin. Ibig sabihin nun, kapag ka ikaw humusga sa iba, ang una mo nang dapat tingnan mo yung sarili mo. Bakit dapat yung sarili mo ang dapat mong tingnan? titingnan mo kung yung puso mo ay nasa tamang lugar. Sapagat yung lamang mga taong may pusong nasa tamang lugar ang may liwanag sa kaisipan. Kapag ka ang puso nasa tamang lugar, lahat nasa tamang lugar. Kapag ka ang puso nasa maling lugar, lahat nasa maling lugar. Kaya nga yung mga taong may pusong malinis, Maliwanag ang pag-iisip. Nasa kanila ang katotohanan, kaya kapag kahumusga, nakikita nila kung alin talaga ang tama, kung alin talaga ang mali. Ayun, hindi ba yan ang pangako ng beatitude? Isa sa mga beatitude, yan ang pangako. Mapapalad ang mga malilinis ang puso sapagkat nakikita nila ang Diyos. Ang mga nakakakita ng Diyos yung malilinis ang puso. Kaya pagka yung malilinis ang puso, tumingin sa iyo, walang malisya. Malinis eh. Kaya nga sabi natin yung mga magulang, walang malisya sa anak. Yung kabutihan lang ng anak, ang nasa isip nila nagmamalasakit. Yung mga guro, may pangako yan, ay tataguyod. Ang kaisipan ng mga bata, pangako yan ng kanilang profesyon, kaya tayo umaasa na kasanilang paghusga sa kanilang mga tinuturuan e eh para sa kanilang kabutihan. Yung mga matitinong mamamayan, ang iniisip kapakanan ng bayan. Kaya kapag sila may mga kulo-kulo, maaaring nakakasakit ng damdamin, Paminsan-minsan, hindi yun ang intensyon. Ang intensyon ay sapagkat ibig nilang bumuti ang patakaran para sa kapakanan ng lahat. Walang malisya bakit mabuti ang puso. At ang mga taong may malinis na puso, nakikita ang Diyos. Ang bawal humusga yung mga maiitim ang budhe. 
marurumi ang kalooban. O nangyari na yan eh sa ating Panginoong Yesu Kristo. Kaya nga nasabi niya yan eh, hinuhusgahan siya. Nung mga taong lumalaban sa kanyang pangaral, minamali yung kanyang ibanghelyo. Ginagawang sinungaling ang ating Panginoong Heso Kristo. Yung inusente, ginagawang makasalanan. Yung mga makasalanan, ginagawang bida. Binabaluktot. Ang mabuting balita, nagiging masamang balita. Ang masamang balita, nagiging mabuting balita. Kaya nakabantay lagi sila sa ating Panginoong Yesu Kristo. Nakikinig ko ano kanyang sasabihin para nang sa ganon, baluktutin sa pakikinig ng tao. Nang magkalito-lito ang mga nakikinig sa ating Panginoong Yesu Kristo. Nangyari yan noong panahon niya, kaya sabi, mali-mali ang husga niyo, galing sa Malaysia niyo yan eh, sabi ng ating Panginoon. Ngayon, nangyayari din yan. Malala pa! Ang husgahan ngayon na galing sa maruming budhi. Ngayon, ginagawang sistematiko at negosyo ang pagsisinungaling at pagkakalat ng mga maling balita. Tungtuwa sila pag merong nadedenggoy. Kumikita na sila. Madali pang lukohin ang mga tao na mahihina ang pag-iisip at hindi nagsusuri kung totoo kanilang sinasabi. At nagiging ahente pa nila sa pagpapalaganap ng mga masasamang balita. Tuwang-tuwa sila. Ito yung mga tinatawag nating tropa ng fault finders. Maligaya sila kapag ang kasinungalingan ay lumalaganap. Mga fault finders, walang ginawa kundi pintasan yung katotohanan. Eh, yun ang kaligayahan ng mga fault finder. Sabi nga nila, eh, ito raw ang ninth beatitude. Ninth beatitude. Ano ba yung ninth beatitude? Walo lang po ang nakalagay sa Biblia. Dinagdaga ng no, mga masasama ang isip, ninth beatitude. Ano yun? Happy are the fault finders, for they will never be disappointed. Yung mga naninira ng puri at dangal, mga chismos at chismosa na walang ginawa kundi mamintas, maliligaya. Bakit? Sapagkat kahit papaano, makakakita ka talaga ng kapansanan at kapintasan. Eh kung yan ang ginawa mong pampalipas oras, yung ba mga taong nakadungaw sa bintana at saka lahat ng mga taong dumadaan, pinipintasan. Eh ngayon, iba na, no? Hindi lang ngayon namiminta na. Oh, sistematiko na. Ginagawa ng negosyo. Nagtotrolling na. Nagbabashing na. Yan mga terminology ngayon na wala nung panahon ko. Nung araw, panahon ko, mga pintasero at pintasero lang. Ngayon, ano, sophisticated na. Okay. Meron kang mahusay na cellphone at marami kang alagad. Isang bitlot mo lang. Nako, yung kasinungalingan, umiikot. Yung paninirang puri, eh gumagala. At dahil binabayaran ka, at dahil nagtatagumpay ka, tuwang-tuwa ka. Ayun na naman katuwaan yan. Kaya nga sabi nila, yung ninth beatitude, happy are the fault finders for they will never be disappointed. Diabolical. Maladimonyo. Sapagkat yung mga natutuwa lang kapag ka ikaw yung naloloko, yung mga pumapalakpak pag ikaw yung nadadapa, 
Yung mga tuwang-tuwa at sinasabing, buti niya, buti niya. Oh. Kapag ikaw'y nasasawi, hindi Diyos yun. Demonyo lang yung natutuwa sa ganun. Eh ngayon, marami ng ganyan, nagkakalas ng kung ano-ano, pumapalakpak, may pera pa. At tayo naman, mga hindi nagsusuri, lunok naman ng lunok, at hindi lang nilulunok. Niluluwa pa nakikiisa tayo sa pagpapalagana. Lumalagana pang kadiliman. Hindi mo nalalaman. Nakakalungkot. Nakakalungkot. Na ngayon di mo malaman kung sino nagsasabi ng totoo at kung sino nagsasabi ng kasinungalingan. Nakakalungkot pero hindi nakakawala ng pag-asa. Alam niyo yung kadiliman, napakahina. Napakahina ng kadiliman. Yan ay para lang sa mga duwag eh. Yung mga nagtatago sa dilem, nakaw para lang sa duwag. Kaya napakahina niya. Kahit na lumalagap ang kadiliman, sandali lang yan. Magsindi ka lang na isang kandila. Nawawala na dilem. Ganyang kadali. Labanan. Ang kasinungalingan. Kung bawat isa sa atin magsisindi lang ng isang kandila. Dila! Kung bawat isa sa atin walang sasabihin kundi katotohanan. Kahit na dumadami ang sinungaling, madaling sukpuin. Kahit na merong isa, dalawa, tatlo, apat, magsimulang magsabi ng katotohanan. Mapapalis ang kadiliman. Sana kayo yun. We all stand to pray. For every intention, we are going to say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear Lord, our, our prayer. prayer. That the church may fulfill her ministry of healing and forgiveness. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That government officials may show care and concern for the poor and the marginalized. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That we may be able to see our own faults and refrain from passing judgment on the failures of others. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That the sick, the lonely, and the handicapped may find strength in healing. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That our departed relatives and friends may find peace and eternal joy. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. Almighty Father, grant us the courage to be brave in the face of darkness, and having that courage, even by lighting just one candle, we might be able to dissipate the terror of darkness. We ask you this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Please be seated.
Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. This will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this wine to offer, fruit of the divine works of human hands. This will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name for our good and the good of all his holy church. O God, who graciously accomplished the effects of your mysteries, grant, we pray, that the deeds by which we serve you may be worthy of these sacred gifts. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For just as through your beloved Son you created the human race, so also through him with great goodness you formed it anew. And so it is right that all your creatures serve you, all the redeemed praise you, and all your saints with one heart bless you. Therefore we too extol you with all the angels, as in joyful celebration we acclaim. of all holiness make holy therefore these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ at the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion he took bread and giving thanks broke it he gave it to his disciples saying take this all of you and eat of it this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Mm -hmm. 
celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection we offer you Lord the bread of life and the chalice of salvation giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit remember Lord your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with francisco our pope socrates our bishop fidelis our auxiliary bishop gerard the master of the order of preachers and all the clergy remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy welcome them into the light of your face have mercy on us all we pray that with the blessed virgin mary mother of god saint joseph her beloved spouse with the blessed apostles saint dominic and saint francis and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your son jesus christ through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. stand. Let us pray with confidence to the Father in the words our Savior gave us. Our Father who, who art in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the Christ. kingdom, the power, and the glory of yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Peace, kneel. Behold, this is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this communion. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Please all stand. Blessed be the Lord, for he has come to his people and set them free. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel, for he has come to his people and set them free. He has raised for up to mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised the foe that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sin. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on heart shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Blessed, Blessed be the, the Lord, Lord, for he has come, come to his people and set, set them free. Let us pray. Renewed and nourished by the sacred body and precious blood of your Son, we ask of your mercy, O Lord, that what we celebrate with constant devotion may be our sure pledge of redemption through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Tapos puso po kami nagpapasalamat sa inyong lahat na nakiisa sa amin sa pagdiliwang ng Santa Eucharistia. Naway pagpatuloy po ninyo ang inyong pagdarasal para sa mga naglilingkod sa inyo dito sa Basilica Minore of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawa. At makakasa kayong pagpapatuloy din namin ng pagdarasal para sa inyo at sa inyong mga minamahal sa buhay. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. The Almighty God bless you. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. Now we pray and bless the sick, then followed by the blessing of rosaries and other religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness towards our sick and aging brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness, restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa, May these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.